<laughs> uh, thing is, I thought all along Aaron Rodgers was right. plan A. Turns out that I was wrong. You look at this thing and you talk about your roller coaster days. Broncos country bumming hard this morning after Aaron Rodgers announced that he would stay and play with the Packers. 45 minutes later, cloud nine as the Broncos traded for Russell Wilson. First star under center around here in years, 10 years, not since Peyton. And as it turns out, this was the Broncos top target, not Aaron Rodgers. That actually makes sense too. Both are stars, but Wilson, the former Colorado Rockies draft pick, by the way, is five years younger than Rodgers. Denver did give up a bunch to get him, gave up three players, three starters, Drew Locke, Noah Fant, and Shelby Harris, plus five draft picks, two ones, two twos, and a fifth rounder as well. But still, it's a deal that Denver had to do. You had to be better at quarterback. The NFL is a QB league. We've got one now to win. Denver does. This is a great day for the Broncos. The trade can't be made official until March 16th. That's the start of the league year. We'll have much more coming up on the big trade when Mike Kliss joins us later in sports. Also, in a way, it's sort of bad news for Justin Simmons because he's gone back to back to back on the Walter Payton Man of the Year Award. <laughs> well, Russell Wilson has actually won the national Walter Payton Man of the Year Award. So great on the field, great off the field. This is a huge deal for Denver. I think those two leaders will do a lot. <laughs> Cannot wait. A lot of excitement around Broncos country. Tell you